kids are going to come downstairs right now and we're going to finish a little sciencey project that we had started earlier this morning. Are you guys coming? Okay, come on. We're talking about molecules. Um, of course, the younger kids just understand that, you know, things are made of molecules. <laughs> I said when you open an orange and you smell an orange, you're smelling the orange molecules that reach her nose. Anyway, so who knows what they're thinking, but what we were going to do is try and create carbon dioxide molecules by putting baking soda into the vinegar and the byproduct of that is carbon dioxide and you're supposed to try and pour some of the carbon dioxide without pouring the liquid in the bags and seeing which one's heavier air or carbon dioxide but i'm having trouble like making this go to something and like holding this so i thought i'd try this little balance thingy to see if it'll work better so right now it's balanced and then if one is lighter then it should teeter totter so we'll do that instead but if you don't have a little balance like this you can try a meter stick or yard stick if you want to do this experiment at home and then just two regular lunch sacks so we'll try it so this balance is pretty pretty even this one may be up a little bit so let's adjust it a little bit hold on move to see <laughs> They're very excited about this, except Dee's trying to get that balloon from the ceiling. Anyways, okay, this looks a little better. Maybe even a little tad more. Okay, let's see. Stop, move your hand, boop. That looks pretty balanced right there. Try not to touch it. So we have just bags. Each bag is just filled with air. The whole trick to this, and I've taped it so it wouldn't fall. The trick to this is figuring out how to make the carbon dioxide molecules actually go in the bag Can I without this? pouring the liquid in the bag. Can I put this in? No, what you're going to do is you're going to take that cup of baking soda and put, this in. and put it in the bucket. Okay. See the bucket? Can I put it in now? Pour it in the bucket, yeah. Okay. And then pour the vinegar. And of course it's going to start bubbling and reacting. Whoa. No, wait. Whoa. <laughs> So now we're gonna try and make it so some of these molecules go in the bag. Which, how do you do that? Okay, do you see that though? Which way is it pointing? Do you see how I'm kind of leaning it towards that bag? Yeah. And why is it pointing down, do you think? Because, why is this one now down? Even though I didn't pour anything in there. Because the molecules are in there and it just made it hard. I just made it heavier than the air. So do you think the carbon dioxide molecules are heavier than the air molecules? Yeah. That is correct. You are correct. Ding, ding, ding. You win a prize. Okay, so whenever you pour this towards the bag, the carbon dioxide molecules replace the air molecules, and they weigh more, and this, thus the teeter-totter was down. All right. Good experiment. The end. <laughs> Did you like that experiment? Yeah! Oh my goodness. You want to taste some frosting, Chris? This is really delicious, Steve. Yuck. Mm. Hey, Briz, that is really baking soda. No, Please it's not. Don't eat that. Yeah, it is. You can't trick me. Then why don't you try it yourself? Mmm! <laughs> so good! <laughs> You're just pretending. So the goose. Uh huh. See? That didn't touch your tongue. <laughs> You're not fooling anybody. Yummy. You want to crack your geode? You're sending your jammies. Let's go outside and crack your geode. She got this little thing for her birthday, and inside are sometimes crystals, sometimes it's just not, and it's ugly. But we'll see if this one. So we'll see if this one ends up having pretty stuff in it. You want to crack it with a hammer? All right. Oh, move, D, so you don't get hit. Whoa, it's harder to crack than we thought, huh? Keep going. I gotta get here, Chris. Yeah. Watch out. Yeah, Watch out. <gasps> Whoa, that one smashed it. Let's see what the pieces look like. <gasps> it's a crystal, it's a crystal. Is it? Let's see. It's a crystal. I knew it. Whoa, there's a little bit of the crystal in there. I knew it. Where are the other this pieces? This is the other piece right here. There's, so little, the there's little crystals right there. I don't know if you can see it very well. This, this one crystal. has the best example of the crystals because they're growing up a little bit. See, those aren't crystals. Those are kind of hard rocks. to focus on them though. They're right in there. Yeah. 
These have you crystals see them. on them. Yours have little crystals. Some of them are really big, you know. Whew, it's so cold out here. Oh my goodness. It's like Don't you want to try and open this one? Let's let's crack this Can one I one more it? time. No, 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 no. Let's just go like this. You're breaking it. Woo! Did you see the spark? Yeah. yeah. It was a spark. Did, did you see the I spark? Saw, I saw it. Yeah. Why is there a spark? I wonder if there's like flint in there. There probably is. Because you Cause see it, that black stuff? Yeah. <laughs> can I Can I do it? Sure. I'll make some All right, everybody has to Let's scoot back. We're plate. making fire I from rocks. We're like cavemen. Booga! <laughs> Booga! 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 I knew it was a crystal. Oh, I know. Good job, Dee Dee. He's doing pretty good. This is his first time skating. <laughs> Whoa! She's doing pretty good. Whoops. There's birds back there. Because you never know when they're going to do it. Yeah, whoa. Like the dots on the floor. Yeah. Hi, Dee. Dee Dee, you coming with us? Good. Skate to me. Woo, look at this. Good job, big girl. You're doing so good. You guys like skating? Yeah. It is hard. Ooh, it is hard work. It's like a workout. What? <laughs> he wants to do the ski ball. He didn't bring any quarters though. So they decided to practice on the carpet for a little while. So they can get used to it better. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. Careful! Whoa! <laughs> Everybody got some ice cream and snowballs. We got cheesecake ice cream. I got cherry and pina colada. And these are our friends here. Hello. <laughs> what flavor did you get, Briz? Vanilla. Just vanilla. You're a vanilla girl. What'd you get, Dee? Strawberry. Mm-hmm. I like that. This is delicious. Oh my gosh. This is the first time I've had this. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna come here more often. Why did you like roller skating, Dee? Because it has Open game sound, everything is awesome. A preview. Oh, yeah? yeah? It did Gangnam style and everything is awesome? Yeah. How is your, your ice cream and everything? Good. Delish. Good. What are you reading, Boo? Garfield. How many books of Garfield have you read? A ton. 50, <laughs> at least, <laughs> probably. She loves those Garfield comic strips. Which is so funny because I used to read them and have them as a girl too. So I think she must take after her mother. <laughs> and been here before. They shave the ice so it's really thin and it like melts in your mouth. It is delicious. So we'll definitely be back here. Love it. Homemade ice cream. The real deal. And it's pretty cheap. I want to make my own snowball stand. Would you guys like to work at my snowball stand when I get one? Sure. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we might have to know the ingredients. You might have to know the ingredients. That's right. We should get and a snow cone. Please bring box. vanilla ingredients. Vanilla ingredients. And cheesecake. Okay, sounds good. Even chocolate. Even, mommy, what do I have? You have blue raspberry and cherry. Make blue raspberry. Blue, Blue raspberry, raspberry. Mm -hmm. and cherry. Okay. So that will be good for me. Mm -hmm. So you yeah, have to make a, a ingredients. <laughs> I like the way you say ingredients. 